Gentlemen, rookie sportsmen, you should be on the grid. Yamaha Light, you should be on making your way to the grid. Yamaha Light, if you haven't gone through the fuel system, please do so. There goes Jack. Yamaha Light, please go to the grid. Okay, four cycles, stock heavy. Starting on the pole. It is Chris, Mr. Coyote Coyote. Carroll, he is starting on the pole, car number 12. Outside pole, out of Monsignor Racing, it is brother Frank Monsignor in the number 22 machine. Starting in third, out of Monsignor Racing also, it's the number 5, and he has made it up into the second row. Joe is a whole other story, big boy. Starting alongside him, that is JRB Racing, Monsignor Racing, the other brother, number 51, Tom Monsignor. Starting in fifth place is the 35 of Jason Sierra. In sixth, out of Steinway Racing, Racing, Bonsignor Racing is the 04 of Carl Vordemeyer. In seventh, it's the number 99 of Robert Kroll. Alongside him, the number nine of Bob Bolt. Then it's Bob Van Hooseltop. Steve Morsi. And the number 19 of Benny DeLucia. That's how they stack up in his first heat of the Sabella Recording Studios. Four cycle stock heavy. Up next will be the Blenzoil rookie sportsman. On the grid should be rookie sportsman and Yamaha Light. Rookie Sportsman and Yamaha Light, please, you should be on the grid. Super 100, if you get fuel, I'm not sure, you should be going to the fuel system. Super 100, if you do get fuel, I don't know what the rules are in the Super 100, but if you do get fuel, please go to the fuel system. If not, get ready to grid up right after this next class run. All right. This is the first heat of the Sabella Recording Studios Four Cycle Stock Heavy. Sitting at the front, number 12, at Coyote Racing Products. It is Chris Carroll. Outside pole, the number 22 of Here Frank Monsignor at a Monsignor Race Engine. Let's find it. He gets the green early on. And Carroll looks like he got a good jump. And Frank Monsignor though knows this track, but Monsignor has to settle for second and he pops the chain. It looks like Frank Monsignor oh, is no. tied up going through that second turn. He might have got nudged, and that's all it took, and it looked like he popped the chain. I'm not sure, but he's out of it. So Chris Carroll now catches a break and is out in front. Second place is the number five of Coleman right, Goya. Go. Number 51 of Tom Monsignor Woo. now runs third. So a tough break for Frank Monsignor out of Monsignor Racing. Oh. I believe he might have popped the chain. I'm not sure, but he caught it coming out of that turn. But he was holding his line, doing a good job. A tough break. He'll be back, though, in the next two weeks. Keep an eye on him. Point number 12, Chris Carroll out in front. In second, another Montreal racing, Joe Mignoia. No problem. They pick up the banner and start running with it. Frank bon uh, Tom Montreal runs in third. But Chris Carroll has a good, sizable lead. He caught a break when Frank went out on turn two. Joe Mignoia runs second. Tom Montreal in third. It's the 0-4 of Carl Wortemeyer. Running in fourth. Your leader is the number 12 out of Coyote Products, Chris Carroll. He's got a good lead. In second is the five of Joe Victoria. And the 51 of Tom Montgomery. The 35 of Jason Sierra. And the 0 4 of Carl Wortemeyer. Carl Wortemeyer has fallen back to fifth with Jason Sierra, number 35, moving up to fourth. So a little bit of a shake-up on that first lap, and that opens the door for some of these other races. And look at the number five, Joe, another oh story, no. Victoria. In a national event, he is now running second. He's got the master though behind him, Tom the Duct Tape Monsignor, number 51. Tom has been racing for an awful long time in his four-cycle rank. He is cool, calm, and collected on that track. So keep an eye on 51, his experience is carrying him to the front. Running in third is the 35 of Jason Sierra. In, I mean, in fourth and fifth is the 0 4 of Paul Mortemeyer, followed by the number 99 of Robin oh, Crow, no. who runs in sixth. Watch out for Tom! getting up there, he's running in the sixth place position. Right now, the lead belongs solely to the Come number on, 12 no. at a Coyote no. product, Chris Carroll. He is making it look easy Watch here today on Tom. a Sunday afternoon at the West Hampton Card Stadium. Running in second, and with a two more cars right behind him is the number five of Joe Mignoia. Behind him is the 51 of Tom Montiore and the 35 of Jason Sierra. And those three cars, in this case, it could be anybody.
everybody's second place position, but right now, Joel Mangoya is the guy who holds on to it. Tom Bonsignor runs in third, Sierra runs in fourth, Come on, Joe. and I believe the zero Step for on Paul it. Fortemeyer, it is running in a distant fifth. Fortemeyer is out of that second pack draft, he rubs it in to catch up, but he can do it. Your leader continues to be the number 12 of Chris Carroll. This is the first heat of the Sabella Recording Studios four cycle stock heavy. First heat of the day in this Eastern Sprint Point Challenge Series being brought to you by some of the racing tires. So continuing to hold the lead is the number 12 of Chris Carroll. He's got a good lead. No challenge for his position. The race is for third, but right now doing a great job of holding down that third place position is the number five of Joe Mangoya. The 51 of Tom Montenegro runs in fourth. I mean, it's, uh, Mangoya holds on to that second place. Tom Montenegro holds on to third. And in fourth is the 35 of Jason Sierra. So some great racing in this first heat of the four cycle stock heavy. They get the two lap signs. And Monsignor Tom, that is, goes to the inside of Mangoya, trying to move into that second place. But Mangoya does a great job of holding on to his line. He gave Tom the room. He did not chop down on him. A tremendous right, job go. by Joel Mangoya. Great on, driving go. by Joel Mangoya and Tom Bonsignor. The number 35 of Jason Sierra sits there in fourth and just watches. He is ready to strike at any given moment. Let's see if Tom Bonsignor now with the white flag waving. Let's see if he makes an attempt. Your leader Come on, Joe, to be the number one 12 more. Chris Carroll. Chris Carroll. Come on, Joe, got block a very him. good lead. Here he comes. He'll get the white block flag. Him. Chris Carroll still out in front at a Coyote Prize. Come on, Joe, Joe block Mayer him. Joe Mayer runs in second. Tom Montenegro in third. Jason Sierra in fourth. And the zero four of Paul Watermeyer in fifth. And this time, Tom Montenegro does not put a challenge onto Joe Mangoya. He could not get a Come good on, run Joe. on down that straightaway. So Mangoya on his way to a second place finish yes. in his first heat of the Sabella Recording Studio. Come on, Joe. Stock heavy. Kick Chris Carroll out. looks around. He's got a go. tremendous Woo. lead right now. No problem for him. Look at the Come number on, Joe. Keep it. Tom Montenegro now. He's trying to get a run on the number five of Joe Mangoya. Keep it. As they go around the carousel. Here comes your leader and winner, the number 12 of Chris Come Carroll. Come on, Joe. Carroll Keep it. Don't let him easily. catch it. And second is the number five of Joe Mangoya. Let's see if he can hold it. And he does. Woo.
Here they go, getting ready for the race. There's Joe, shot in second. Inside. He's starting second. On the right, the inside pole. Or is it the outside pole? Outside pole, starting second, I believe. Then again, who knows? Come on, Joe. Joe, right now he's in third. Keep an eye on the Boston York Brothers coming up through the pack. Oh, 
I guess they're not out there. I'm reading the line on, on that angle. They're out there, they're out there. Keep an eye on number 22 as Frank Bonsignor already has picked his way and he's moving into fourth. Chris Carroll, I mean, has got fourth. Frank Bonsignor in fifth. Let's get a lineup as they come down. Number 35, Jason Sierra is in the lead. The 0-4 of Fortemeyer is in second. The 99 of Robin And now, Frank Bonsignor going for that first place position. And he gets in front of Carroll. And he gets fourth. Chris Carroll runs in fifth. So Frank Bonsignor coming up from the 10th starting position has moved himself already up into fourth. In the lead is the number 35 of Jason Sierra. In second, the 0-4 of Carl Mortemeyer. And look at Frank Bonsignor, Chris Carroll, Tom Bonsignor, and Joe Mingoya on the ball trying to get through that pack. They are coming through. Look out. Your leader continues to be the number 35 of Jason Sierra. In second, it's the 0-4 out of Steinway Racing. Bonsignor Race Engine is Paul Watermeyer. In third, out of Bonsignor Race Engine, it's the number 22, your current points leader, Frank Bonsignor. And in, in fourth, it's the number 12 of Chris, Mr. Coyote Carroll, out of Coyote Racing Products. In fifth, it is the number 51 of Tom Bonsignor at a JRB Racing and Bonsignor Racing Engine. Okay, let's get a line up again as they come through the carousel. It's the number 35 of Jason Sierra out in front. The 0-4 out of Carl Watermeyer is still holding on to second. But he's got the number 22 of Frank Bonsignor right behind him. And the number 12 of Chris Carroll. And then the 51 of Tom Turn it is the number 
35 of Sierra. He is holding on. He's got the 22 of Frank Bonsignor right behind him. Chris Carroll runs third. Rodemeyer runs fourth. Tom Bonsignor runs fifth. Joe McGoy. Look at this. Great train. Up the back stretch. Frank Bonsignor is right on the back bumper of Sierra as they go into the carousel. Sierra's got to hold tight. He's got to come down low. He is holding on. Sierra is still in the lead. And number 35 of Jason Sierra. What a seesaw battle here. Here it comes. The number 35. 